Our next paper is on mobile and desktop-based group messaging system. Quoted by DCR Ayla Peruma, AAAS Adhikari, PAC Dilhani, K. Umasutan, MLM Hasmat, Hasamat, and uh, Mrs. Dilni Kulavanza and Sanat Fernando as co-supervisors, I believe. Our presenter this morning would be Mr. AAS Adhikari. Third year internship program. She is also an uh, Oracle certified professional Java programmer. So I think we need to get the technicalities correct before Ms. Adhikari to, uh, is going to present. We, need to, we have the slides. Yes. Uh, so, ladies and gentlemen, let's welcome Ms. Adhikari to present her project uh, findings on mobile and desktop based group messaging systems. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I'm here to present our group research project, Mobile and Desktop-Based Group Messaging System. This would, this would be the presentation outline for today. If we take communication, communication has become a vital part in humans' life from ancient times. And with the involvement of technology, it has, become, it has transformed drastically over the past few years. And now group communication has become an essential need in both personal and corporate aspects. However, inefficient and ineffective communication can lead to many complications. If I talk about the complications, delivery and responsing, responding on time, and security of data, the corporate aspect, they look for three things. That is privacy, integration, and authentication. And also, because business-sensitive data are passed throughout the group communication systems, they need to be very careful about what they are going to share. So we conducted a survey in prior to the research, and we found out that 77% of the corporate think that secure group messaging is important. So our proposed solution is a mobile and desktop-based group messaging system. Since uh, this is a compelling problem, there are other existing applications and systems. So as you can see, uh, there are four other systems that we found, and most of them have group messaging and mobile-based and uh, chat. However, SMS services, message encryption, and dynamic features are lacking in these systems. So our aim is to develop a mobile and desktop-based secure group message system and reduce communication barriers mostly focusing on the corporate aspect. This is our approach. As you can see, the user can choose either the desktop application, mobile application, or both, and they can communicate the message to a group of people using a web server. And also, to notify about the message for offline users, we have connected a SMS gateway. Going into more detail, I'll present the top-level architecture of the system. Uh, the user can send desktop uh, message from desktop application and Android applications. Those messages are encrypted and could only be decrypted by the application itself. It goes to the web server. In this implementation, we have used the open file server. And from the open file server, the messages are communicated back and forth. So the open file server is connected to the organization where the admin control is applied there. So when creating user accounts and other, all the privileges, there, there, sh there will be admin control over the system. And if the open file server detects some offline users, they will, that will connect to the SMS gateway and SMS notifications will be sent as SMS to their phones. Talking about the features, we have group messaging system and also one-to-one -one messages messaging where users can uh, send private messages within a group and also live update of the system. I'll elaborate more on this. Uh, 
when the sender uses a message, this system to send an invitation to a meeting or an event, the recipients get a response sheet. So they can respond either saying they are coming or not. And from the sender's end, he can see a live update of the response. So he can see the attendance list. And also we have SMS notifications to offline users. So in that way, the whole communication mechanism will be integrated. Implementation, uh, our system has four main uh, components. That is mobile application, desktop application, web server, and SMS gateway. The mobile application is done for Android uh, because we initially we chose Android because uh, the largest smartphone market penetration in the world is for Android. And initially, we are starting with the gingerbread version and, find, and also upgrading it. The encryption algorithm used is AES128. And in the desktop application, uh, we have developed it using NetBeans and Swing libraries. The web server we have used is OpenFire. Uh, that is an instant messaging and group chat server. Uh, so the, why we chose uh, OpenFire server is that it has some unique features that would be beneficial for our implementation, mostly concerning on administration control and database connectivity. I think it's having some issues, so I'll uh, give the demonstration uh, after the presentation. So after the implementation, uh, we conducted a survey to evaluate the project. So what we did was we conducted a survey in a live organization environment where we tested this application at Ridgecrest Asia Private Limited. So 45 employees were given this questionnaire to evaluate the system. And uh, as I mentioned before, we, had a, we did a market research survey and also, we, uh, for this, we use the feedback form, uh, feedback from the users of the system. This is the questionnaire that we presented, and the following evaluation aspects were tested. Installation process, so this shows the feedback summary that we got. The average response rate was 3.5, and as you can see, installation process of both mobile and desktop application recorded uh, value uh, higher than the average and the user friendliness and the rating with comparison to other systems lie around the average. Satisfaction gained after using the product was 3.43 out of 5, and battery consumption and memory consumption was 3.18. So this is an insight uh, for you to understand uh, our system against other existing systems. So uh, apart from the general features, we have unique features like uh, having the desktop and mobile application both, and uh, message encryption and live update of the respon uh, responses. So the system that we have implemented is, to, is for corporate use, but it could be used for personal usage as well. This is a mobile solution uh, for secure messaging in uh, groups. And also this reduces the time taken uh, to respond by integrating mobile application, desktop application, SMS notification. So this, is, uh, this could be used to overcome the communication barriers. So we are hoping to develop more on this, so ongoing research work. We are hoping to improve the efficiency in battery and memory consumption, add uh, personalized features, and uh, make a platform implemented mobile uh, solution and also to provide uh, the feature to add customized plugins for users. These are some of the references that we have used. Uh, before winding up, I would like to thank the system administrator at Ridgecrest Asia for assisting us with the technical support, and also our friends and families uh, for supporting us to continue the research work. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I will uh, show you the video. So this is a system so you can log in. And uh, if you want, uh, in the organizational environment, you can give an advanced configuration as well. From this, you can see the users. And uh, if you want to invite a friend, uh, you can search for friends. So you can see the details. And once uh, they accept the uh, invitation, you can uh, communicate with them. So that is individual chatting. So if you are making a group, you can give a topic to the uh, group, like if you are conducting a meeting. So you can invite the group members. 
So it is about a meetup. So you can give the details of the date and time and everything uh, with the attendance response. So you can give the attendance uh, responses like this, the options they can use. So the message is sent to all, the, all, all of the people in the group. So some of them may use mobile, some of them may use desktop. So once they send the message, I can see whether they are attending or not. So once the people start on replying, you can see uh, how the live update systems go. So that is our system. Thank you very much for listening. Thank you very much.